Have you ever heard of black holes? They are some of the most mysterious and fascinating objects in the universe. They are so powerful and mysterious that even scientists have a lot to learn about them. But what exactly is a black hole? Well, a black hole is a region of space where the gravitational force is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape from it. This is because the mass of a black hole is concentrated in a small, extremely dense area called the singularity. Black holes can be classified into three main types, stellar, intermediate, and supermassive. Stellar black holes are the smallest and most common type. They are formed when a star collapses in on itself at the end of its life. The star's gravity is so strong that it crushes the star into a tiny, ultra-dense point, creating a black hole. Intermediate black holes are larger than stellar black holes, but smaller than supermassive black holes. They are thought to form from the collapse of very massive stars or the merger of two smaller black holes. Supermassive black holes are the largest type of black hole. They can be millions or billions of times more massive than the Sun and are often found at the center of galaxies. Scientists think that these black holes formed shortly after the Big Bang, the event that marked the beginning of the universe. So how do we know black holes exist if we can't see them? Well, scientists use telescopes and other instruments to study the effects of black holes on the objects around them. For example, if a black hole is pulling in gas and dust from a nearby star, the star will start to heat up and give off bright light. This is called an accretion disk. Black holes can also be detected by the way they affect the orbits of nearby objects. For example, if a black hole is orbiting a star, the star will speed up as it gets closer to the black hole and slow down as it moves farther away. This is because the black hole's gravity is pulling the star towards it. Now, you might be wondering what happens if you fall into a black hole. Well, first of all, it's important to remember that black holes are very far away and it would be very difficult to accidentally fall into one. But let's say you did somehow manage to fall into a black hole. As you got closer to the black hole, you would start to feel the effects of its intense gravity. You might feel like you were being stretched out or pulled in different directions. This is called spaghettification. Eventually, you would reach the event horizon, the point of no return. Once you pass the event horizon, there's no going back. You would be sucked into the black hole and never be seen again. But don't worry. You don't have to worry about falling into a black hole anytime soon. Black holes are fascinating objects that we still have a lot to learn about, but they are also very far away and not something you need to worry about in your everyday life. Answer the following questions. 1. What is a black hole? 2. How are black holes classified? 3. How are stellar black holes formed? 4. What is an intermediate black hole? 5. How are supermassive black holes thought to have formed? 6. How do scientists detect black holes? 7. What is an accretion disk? 8. How do black holes affect the orbits of nearby objects? 9. What is spaghettification? 10. What is the event horizon? I hope you enjoyed learning about black holes. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to our channel.